For most kids, sports are an important part of school, but for children attending religious schools, beliefs can make it difficult to participate in physical education. Annenberg Media's Dan Lovey shows us how one coach is overcoming these barriers. Ben Yeager is not your typical PE coach. He works at Amic Hebrew Academy in Sherman Oaks, California, an Orthodox Jewish elementary and middle school. The religious school hasn't had a functioning athletic program since it was founded in 1961. But Jaeger has already started to change that. It's hard to create that atmosphere of togetherness and school pride when there's never been really anything like that. So it, it takes some time, but I think uh, we're, we're getting there. Sports and Orthodox religion don't normally go hand in hand. Jaeger and his students face challenges that most other children their age don't have to deal with. You know, the one thing is difficult for the boys is that they have to wear a kippah when they play. Sometimes that's, that's obviously different. The girls, there are, it's harder for them. They have to wear skirts when they play because of the um, religious beliefs. So they have to wear long skirts and long shirts, and that makes it very difficult for them. Scheduling can also cause problems. Religious studies occupy most of the students' time, and in Orthodox Judaism, boys and girls aren't allowed to interact with one another. That means Jaeger has to plan out literally every second when creating the sports schedule for the day. In addition to being the boys' PE instructor, Jaeger also serves as the school's athletic director and varsity basketball coach. Last year, Jaeger said there were barely enough students who wanted to sign up for the basketball program. This year it's been a completely different story. So many kids wanted to sign up that, unfortunately, not all of them could make the team. Jaeger works with students individually after school. That way he can start teaching them the fundamental skills from an earlier age. His coaching style must be working. The varsity team went undefeated this season in the Jewish Day School League before falling short in the championship game. The JV team, however, won the championship in quite dramatic fashion. For Annenberg Media, I'm Dan Lovey.